Hello and welcome to Beam NG, where we're reviewing police car versions of these car, these types of cars. Today we're reviewing this one, which is a, an Italian version of this kind of car. It is, oh my god, powerful. It's 0 to 16 3.2 seconds. Well, I've seen faster. 0 to 105.8. Uh, top speed 210 miles an hour. We will drive, and it's gonna be fast as hell. Look at this damn thing! Look at this damn thing! God damn! Look at it! Let's shut the engine down and turn up again. Listen. Oh, that sounds so nice. You can actually open the door and have a look inside. Oh yeah! Actually, we can actually get inside and. Oh my God! Look at this! Look at this! It's so beautiful. I've never seen a police car look so good. God damn! Shut the door. Oh my god! It's so beautiful. It's so beautiful. It makes me want to cry. Okay. First, we need to spawn some victims. I mean, uh, traffic to arrest. Uh, spawn normal. And then we're going to tell them to flee once we've. Oh, we could get, actually, we can catch everything. Come on, there's not, nothing's going to spawn unless it's one of these versions that we can't catch. So, and we're going to tell them to flee. Right. Let's hit the road. <laughs> the engine's so loud, it's drowning out the sirens. Man, I've got, so, I've got so much power here, I could do anything I want. I can catch anyone. Okay, let's spin this guy around. There you go. It'll be fine. Jesus. Okay. Oh, the acceleration. This is like a Formula One car almost. Okay. Um, now we've got a situation. You guys going? I need to get off the road. Right, I'm gonna put that down. You're nicked. Kind of, kind of successful maneuver. But we were a little bit on the wrong side of the road, and oh god, yeah, that wasn't a traditional bit of maneuver. I was gonna say we're gonna run out of room soon, but we've got so much power, we can get actually catch up to people. There you go. Is he going to get away? He's going to get away, isn't he? Okay. Let's reverse out of here quickly before somebody turns up. Uh, we've broken the headlight. Oh, no. Uh, excuse me. Come through. I don't want to damage the car. It's going to break my heart if I damage the car. But I still want to do pit moves. Oh, acceleration. Oh my god, this is so good! Let's go for top speed. Let's see how fast this really goes. In an urban environment. Oh, not good, not good, not good. Okay, we, we, we landed on four wheels. Oh, daddy, I crashed a car. And lost the tyre. <laughs> it's gone. Oh, man. Okay, it's a little bit hard to control at high speed. Can we actually see where the tire's gone? <laughs> it went down there somewhere. Oh, there it goes. It's still going. <laughs> it's my wheel. How much do you reckon that's worth? Probably about grand. <laughs> just, just a wheel. Okay, let's reset that. Okay, now let's do some pit maneuvers. Okay. Well, that's what we're here to review. How well it does pit maneuvers. I love the spoiler, the way the spoiler works. Okay, there you go. There you go. You're nicked. You're nicked. No, 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 you're nicked. You're nicked. You're, you're, ne you're nicked. Come back here, son of a... 
come back. Yeah, I've got slight damage to the steering. I have to wait the spoiler comes up like that when you break. Come here, come here, come here. Oh, I lost it. Ooh. Hey, everybody's nicked here. Everybody's nicked. <laughs> Hello. Jeez. Look at that. That car is mashed. You've got the police lights flashing in there. You'd think people would stop, wouldn't you? Yeah, you're definitely nicked, though, don't you? Yeah, you're definitely nicked. Yeah. Okay. Come back here, come back here. Is this drivable? Uh, I got I got a puncher. But I got, yeah, that's not drivable. I got a rear puncher there. God damn it, it looks so nice. Okay, if we set this. Oh, come back here, come back here. Oh, uh, it's still in the way. Okay, let's just pick our way through the debris here. Um, let's pick somebody who's not damaged. Actually, no, he's not that badly damaged, is he? I'm gonna try and pick you around. There you go. Come on. The only thing is, it just damaged the front of the car. It's very delicate at the front. There you go. Oh dear. Yeah, okay. Sorry about that. That looks a little bit painful. No. You are nicked, my son. You are nicked. Next. Who's next? Yeah, doing pit maneuvers does damage the front. It doesn't damage the front suspension too much, but it does damage the actual front of the um, car. So a, a car like this is such so heartbreaking. Brakes are fairly good. Got anti-lock brakes, of course. A car like this, you expect all the mock cons. You expect everything. ABS. Traction control, I assume it's got traction control. It feels like it's got traction control. Very loud. Very fast. And very crashed. I think I hit something. Was that a rock or a tree trunk or something? Oh my god, this breaks the heart, doesn't it? Oh. There's a few cars out there I haven't done pit maneuvers on. I want to do pit maneuvers. But we're going to have to reset this because, yeah, that's not. Drive for. Okay, okay. Let's go to first person. This is first person. Oh, it sounds nice inside. Inside, it sounds so nice. Okay, it's very hard to do. Oh, use! Son of a. I'm off the road. I'm up. Not quite upside. Yes, I'm upside down. Oh. Did somebody just hit me. <laughs> Hello? Hello? Anybody? Oh, somebody's having a bad time. Oh. I'll turn the engine off. Save the engine. I assume this is a V... I'm guessing it's either V10 or V12 engine. I didn't actually look this. I didn't actually read the stats. Okay, let's reset that. We've got a few more cars I want to pit maneuver on. Like this guy here on the left. Actually, both these cars I haven't done yet. I'm going to do him first. He's. F oh, wait a minute. It okay, let's do it. Come here. There you go, kind of. Are you going to try and get away? You are, aren't you? Come back here. Ooh, that seems sound good. I don't, no, no. Good. Yeah, it feels like it's got traction control. Break, 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 break. Brakes need to be bigger. 
come back here, come back here. There you go. Nicely done. Now, the... okay, give it up. Give it up. You're nicked. You're nicked. You're not going anywhere. Confirmed. Okay, you're nicked. Good. I need to get out. My... Get out of here myself. Can we still get going to the bonnet up? Sound like the engines. Sound like a tire went then. Uh, I think we're okay. I want that white little car. Oh, I lost it. I lost it. Jesus Christ, I lost it. Big time. I've lost half the car. I guess that's a safety feature, isn't it? It just breaks in two like that. Oh. <laughs> the door just popped off. <laughs> that's brilliant. I love it. It's <laughs> the bonk. Yeah, I think we crashed that big time, didn't we? That was a pretty meaty crash. Can we find the rest of the car? Is that my car? Way over here. It is as well, isn't it? That doesn't look too badly damaged, actually. It just split off. That's a nice looking engine, that is. The shame it's not attached to anything anymore. <laughs> there we go, if you found that on the highway, you would have that, wouldn't you? You would have that. You could do something with that engine. You can't really get height with these controls, but yeah. Unbelievable. I think we need to reset that because we can't actually uh, do anything. Right. Okay. I think all that's left is that little car, that white car. Don't know what it's called. I'll point it out to you. Not this one, weaving all over the road. It's that black one there. The one in the middle now. I want him. See, that's how you do a pit manoeuvre. I can't wait for this guy to get some speed up. Sorry. Come on, mate. Come on, get some speed up. That'd do. There you go. Nicely done. Uh, okay. <laughs> this feels like bullying, isn't it? <laughs> Come on, get up there. Can I push him up? Ah, uh, see how fast I can push him up too. I think we got to up to 80 mile an hour then. I think that's faster than the car can actually go. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Let's see if we can push this guy. Yes! I'm going to call that the most aggressive pit manoeuvre ever. Okay, just one up. <laughs> there you go. Get the trash off the highway. Oh, and uh, by the way, you're nicked. There you go. Okay, I want to do a speed test, a proper speed test, even though I've taken some damage. It's a bit good um, test actually, to see how much, how fast it goes with damage. Here we go. Try and make the bend and not go too fast around the bend. Traffic, not a problem. Ooh, yes, can we get to 200? Can we hit 200 without question? And yes. Oh yes. No. Um. Okay. I kind of ran out of road and brakes and brains. My. God, it's folded up on itself. Oh, God, that's nasty. Okay, so let's reset that and let's park it over here. Uh, what shall we say as a rating? 
Well, speed is awesome. Looks are awesome. He does actually do pit manoeuvres. It's fairly stable on the pit manoeuvres, but it's not powerful as a pit manoeuvre. It doesn't have much gravity to its manoeuvres, as in weight and mass, you know? So it's not that easy to pit people around. I'm gonna get, I'm still gonna give this an 8.5. The speed is so intoxicating, it's just like, yeah. But funny enough, I have done better pit maneuvers on slower cars. It needs bull bars at the front. It needs, it needs more weight at the front. More mass at the front, like a armor plated. If it's armor plated, oh, could you imagine it's being armor plated? That'd be so awesome. Okay, one more thing I want to do. One more speed run the other way, because it's just like, oh God, look at this. Yeah, that's definitely traction control. No doubt about that. If it didn't have traction control, we'd be just sitting there. I can't get around these guys. God, it feels so good. Oh, this is risky. Oh, oh. Damn it. Oh, I just so nearly made it around that corner. Does the engine still work? No, the engine's off. Don't you? Oh. I couldn't even, <laughs> didn't have time to say, don't you even think about it. Oh man, it looks so nice and now it's all just, well, not so nice. Do you know what? Even in even in a smashed up state like this, it still looks nice to look at. <laughs> oh, it's like such a beautiful car. Where's my exhaust gone? Actually, where's my engine gone? Of course, somebody's had a boot. Hang on, man. Where's the engine? Did we lose the engine? It's definitely not there, is it? Where the hell's the engine gone? Hang on, let's get a free camera. Are you going to crash into my car? No, it's not. Okay. Oh, wait a minute, I've got some stuff over here. Bumper. So we came down here. Where's the engine? There's some more parts here. What is that? Just a... Uh, I don't know. The engine must have gone airborne over here somewhere, maybe. I just hear somebody crash into my car. No. I can't see it. Yeah, that's the bumper. Maybe it flew down the road. Oh, we've got some stuff down here. There's the body work in it. It could have gone miles. It could have gone absolutely miles. It could be anywhere. Uh dear. If I could see the replay, I can actually calculate where it landed but I can't I had to say, nah, the engine has gone walkabout. Some lucky farmer somewhere has probably found that in his shed or something. <laughs> He's just like, oh, what's this? Because it could have gone down there. We were going at quite a speed, but yeah, I'm going to say engine has gone for a burn. It's gone AWOL, and we are not going to find that anytime soon. It's definitely gone, isn't it? Can we get inside the car? Can we open the door? Uh, no. Camera doors. It is jammed. That's not working. Indicators still work. <laughs> Windows smashed to pieces. Oh, man. That's why I just love looking at it. 
Even if, it, if even if it's even in its smashed up state, look at those massive brakes. Even though they had such massive brakes, it still didn't feel like it had enough braking force. Again, I guess cars this fast don't never have enough braking force, do they? Okay, I'm gonna call it a day. Is there any cars left to review? This is this one. Oh, we got some police cars here. Yeah, we got some old fashioned police cars. And oh, got a whole plethora of peace class here. Four, one, two, three, four. Is there a no five? What is that? Okay. So yeah, there's lots to do. So next time, tune in for that. But in the meantime, I shall bid you adieu. Adios.